Hi guys, this is Sadek from Dragon.com and in this video, we will be answering a very important question of whether or not could you install the official OT updates as well as the official Android OS upgrades on your OnePlus phone if the bootloader is unlocked. So the short answer is yes, you could easily install any OT update or any Android OS upgrades on your stock OnePlus phone running Oxygen OS even if the bootloader is unlocked. So let me show you how is that possible. So as of now, if I go to the system settings menu and go to the developer option, you could see that the bootloader on my phone is already unlocked. You could see the status form here. Now even if I go to system updates, there is a pending OTA update and I could easily down. You will first get a message that an OEM unlock is detected. System will begin downloading the full upgrade package to ensure your data integrity. Please perform a backup. So it will ask you to perform a backup. Type on OK. Now you could, as you could see, you could easily download and install the any update. This update is for the latest Android 12. Currently, I'm on Android 11, Oxygen OS 11, and this is the Android 12 update. As you could see, it's in the chain lock as well. So you could easily download and install the any update on your phone, even if the bootloader has been unlocked. Just make sure to take a backup beforehand to be on the safer side. So I will now let you show the status as well. So the downloading has now begun and it's now installing. So guys, there is one important thing to keep in mind that if your phone is rooted, then you cannot directly install the OTA update. For that, you will have to patch the Magis boot image file and install to the inactive slot. That is a, a topic of discussion for some other day. As of now, I would like to say yes, you could install any OTA update and major Android OS upgrades on your OnePlus phone even if the bootloader has been unlocked. It will not cause any issues. As you could see, it's currently being downloaded. I will also show you the installation process and once that is done, our phone will boot to the Android 12 OS without any issues. If you don't want to take this route and want to be a more on a safer side, then you could go ahead and relock the bootloader, then install the OTA update, and then once again unlock the bootloader. How will that, however, that will be leading to too much time wastage, and moreover, you might not be able to unlock the bootloader on your Android 12 phone. I have seen a few issues with the OnePlus 7 series, wherein many have said that they are no longer able to unlock the bootloader on their OnePlus 7 and 7 Pro devices. So the best bet is to keep the bootloader unlocked itself and then slash and install however, whatever OTA you want to install. For example, I am installing the, a major OS upgrade from Android 11 to Android 12 and it's easily being installed on my phone even when the bootloader has been unlocked. So that's not, not a cause of any concern and let's wait for the downloading to proceed. Once that is done, I will also show you how to install the update. So let's wait while that is happening. So guys, as you could see, the download has now been completed and I will now install this update and get back to you. So let's wait for the time frame. So guys, the update has now started installing and this might take some time depending on whether you are installing an OTA update or doing a major OS upgrade. In my case, I am doing an OS upgrade from Oxygen OS 11 to Oxygen OS 12. So it might take a few minutes. So let me fast forward the video. So guys, the update has now been installed and I will now restart my phone and will let you show the experience of Android 12 OS on an unlocked bootloader. So let's restart our phone now. So guys, my phone has just restarted and as you could see, I am now on Android 12, Oxygen OS 12. Let me reconfirm the same. So if I go to about device, you could see I am on Android 12. So as you could see, it's quite easy to install the official OTA update even if the bootloader on your phone has been unlocked. Let me once again show the status of the bootloader. So if I go to version number and tap on build number 7 time, this will enable developer option. Then if I go to system settings and if I go to developer option, you could see that the OEM unlocking is already grayed out and it's enabled. And it has written that bootloader has been unlocked. So this confirms our decision that you could easily install any OTA update as well as major OS upgrade even if the bootloader on your OnePlus phone is unlocked. So on that note, we round off this video. If you have any queries regarding the same, do let us know in the comment section. And guys, please subscribe to this channel for more tips and tricks. Thanks a lot for watching.